Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 Let's Talk video, and uh, I'm gonna display also all of my outfits that I've gathered throughout beta and up to today's date, which is June the 7th. Are you serious? Why did you come here and spawn these little monsters, man? I'm trying to do a freaking video intro. <laughs> Mr. Clown, you're supposed to entertain people and not mess up my intro. Bad man. Alright, I'm not even gonna edit this. <laughs> so, <laughs> let's continue. So, as I said, I'm gonna display my outfits. All of them that I have the atom, uh, the atom shop. Once, I'm gonna actually show them like this, sort of. I'm gonna be cl clicking and showing you around. Uh, from up all the way down. Then I'll show you, I think, five sets of my uh, favorite outfit sets, right? Starting from the top number one favorite and ending with the least favorite one. After that, I will show you my power armor collection, which is not that big because I don't use power armors. I just started to use it just for the nuclear zones. And uh, honestly, I haven't been using power armors at all. Just like I started using them like two weeks ago. So I have, I think, four or five, four or five, somewhere like that. <laughs> Alright, so let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so let the party begin. I was thinking of making uh, like a slideshow of all the outfits, but it's just so many of them. And it's it will be better if I just open my pit boy and navigate all from the top to bottom. So. Uh, 76 trucker cap. I'm a big fan of caps, so I'm collecting them all. <laughs> so uh, that's a pretty cool cap, actually. It really works with the uh, bomber jacket, uh, also from the Atom Shop. So the American Patriot looks actually cool with the with the bandana. <laughs> not bad. I like it. <laughs> that's the clean one. I'm not sure where exactly I got this one from. I think from buying the actual game. I took the middle plan. I forgot what was the name of it. The Black Cowboy. Okay, that's not the Atom Shop outfit. Black Fisherman's overalls. <laughs> the funny story with this outfit is uh, I bought it during beta. It cost, I think, 400 atoms at that time. And uh, I didn't read what I was buying because we had such limited time to play the beta. And like with the first glance, without reading the title, I thought this was some sort of a marine armor. But then <laughs> when I was running around, I know what the hell is that? Uh, read the name Fisherman. There goes my marine armor. <laughs> so we got the black tuxedo. Ooh. Ah oh, man, the bandana breaks through the colors. Well, that sucks. Uh, black rim sunglasses. I don't like it at all. I mean, what's the difference between the other ones? It's just it's pointless. Uh, the blue bandana, come on bandana. Ah, there we go. <laughs> the worst purchase ever. <laughs> this uh, red, what do you call it? Uh, Clutcher hat is the worst purchase I made. It was 350 atoms. Uh, it went like limited lifetime to buy, and that was the time when I was actually planning to start the limited time to buy uh, or in atom shop videos in general. So I like grabbed it, and then I'm like totally forgot about it like okay you know what just wasted my, my atoms for that the cowboy hat so that's the atom shop one but I still prefer the black one which you can find in White Springs for example there are actually a few locations where you can get the black cowboy hat uh, vest veracity uniform now that's cool I mean it's not cool like that but there is a cool combination that you can make with this outfit uh, so basically this one we got for free, it was way long time ago, and it really looks cool with this, with the green bandana and the green hood. Now the green hood, I did not find the 100% location where I got it, so don't ask me where I got it because last time I made my outfit videos through beta, I was asked a lot of questions and that's when I started to do my 100% guarantee to find outfit locations. So. This one, if you're interested, I found it in, uh, well, it's in Morgantown. You just need to find the place where there are a lot of tents. I actually covered it on one of the uh, outfit videos. I think where I was covering the uh, 
tin foil hat and the bottle caps and it's like a whole bunch of um, items in one video and I covered the location uh, okay one second let me get, get back cowboy hat Eastern Bunny uh, this one we got I got this one from collecting all of the Easter eggs they're right actually behind me right here as you can see and there's the, the black one <laughs> uh, then we've got what's that ah that's a beret that was given to me really looks cool with the survivalist outfit I'm actually gonna display at the end of the video my perfect com combinations fast match eh. I mean it was cool at that point really looks nice with the clean pristine minor uniform this one I like I t time to time I wear it it actually works with a lot of different outfits to be honest uh, where are we? Ah, oh, there we go. Grahan Tucker cap. So as I said, I, I love collecting those caps, so every time a cap pops up, I make sure to get it. Halloween costume was my one of the very first outfits I bought, and I was running in this outfit with a cowboy uh, and a bandana when I was like under level 50, and now I'm level three, almost 300, almost. Then we got the hunting cap the leather cap <laughs> and we got the leather greaser jacket and jeans looks cool oh yeah by the way I forgot about the skins that we have for the bags as well well to be honest this is my favorite one other ones suck actually there's just one more oh no wait two more we got the fridge which I don't like either <laughs> uh, lifted hunting cap then we got the medical smiley. <laughs> uh, that's a bad one. Military. Nukesha. Oh yeah. <laughs> Actually, that looks pretty cool. Hey, why why is the straw just sticking out, man? Well, <laughs> lol. What else do you have here? Okay, that's the dirty one. Wait. Oh, dude, that's a really big freaking hat. <laughs> I don't even know how the hell I got it. The pirate hat I got off sale. Oh, this one is one of my favorites as well. Really looks cool with the Western uh, Duster outfit. And Western Duster outfit actually looks cool with the black cowboy cap and, and the Adam Shop ca uh, cowboy cap and a red bandana. That's power. Oh, that's my favorite one so far. The opossum hat. There we go. <laughs> I love that one. Okay, this one I got off sale just for like, I don't know, maybe it was definitely less than a hundred atoms. Otherwise I wouldn't buy it. But I'm like, okay, fine, let's get it. The red bandana, okay, that's not it. Ah. Red rocket jumpsuit. Ooh, red bandana actually looks cool with it. So I already covered this outfit a couple of times and uh recently actually. Actually went off sale with the big sale that happened uh last Tuesday. It was June fourth, I think. Scientist goggles, goggles, the skull mask. Ooh, the skull mask actually works with the opossum hat. Usually, it breaks through uh, the hats, and that that's really sad. Besides, it doesn't support the bandana. As soon as you wear the bandana, it gets immediately taken off. But Imagine if you could actually put a bandana, right? That would be so cool. I mean, it would be one of my favorite outfits. And, most, and you know what? If you could also like wear the skull mask and goggles and a bandana, that would be freaking insane. I would love that. But that's not the case. So the stalker goggles. I don't know. These are like the Atom Shop goggles. They're kind of okay, but I still for some reason prefer the goggle. those goggles all the way down here these ones I don't know why I just just like those more uh, stars and strips bandana really cool one <laughs> then we've got the survivalist mask the funny thing when I bought the survival outfit I didn't know <laughs> that this thing came with it <laughs> yeah, until one of you guys pointed it out to me and that's how it looks fully with the survival 
so uh, sweater vests and slacks came out with a good discount so that's why I bought it tactical up outfit it's actually an under armor <laughs> so as you can see I mean it does look sort of okay I mean yeah but when I was buying it I thought it was a freaking uh, outfit and not a freaking under armor so I learned my lesson I'm gonna read the description more thoroughly before I do something stupid like this <laughs> Then we've got the Tucker uh, cap, tuxedo, Ew. oh tuxedo hat, my bad, nice clean one, the actual tuxedo, then we've got the bomber jacket which I forgot to show on the last big sale which happened last Tuesday. I love it. Then we got the Vault Tech jumpsuit. Vault Tech lab coat. Clean one. I got the dirty one as well. I found it in a random location spot. But the clean one looks nice. And it actually looks nice with the. Oh, uh, wait. With the white. Wolf fedora and a white tuxedo, by the way. But with with uh, this one right here, ain't that just beautiful? It's actually one of my favorite sets of what I like to wear. <laughs> Vintage football helmet. The cool thing is here with this thing, if I'm not mistaken, and I don't, if I remember correctly, you can actually wear the actual bandana. And you can actually wear the actual Googles. <laughs> Look at that. That is cool. Why doesn't it work the same way for the skull mask? Man, that is so disappointing. <laughs> Alright, what else do we have here? Oh, a vintage football outfit is actually uh, an Under Armour. So, there we go. It's actually an Under Armour. Oh, all right. So then the, we got the West Virginia cap. Western Duster. See, I told you it looks cool with the red bandana. <laughs> uh, the white tuxedo, which we just covered. Worn. Okay, I have the clean one, so I pretty much don't use this one. <laughs> And that's it. That's all I got. Oh yeah. Uh, so the power armor, right? Unfortunately, I have only one power armor, so I'm gonna have to make a few cuts and redo the power armor. Where the hell is it? Ah. Uh, okay. You know what? Let me show you the best uh, combinations of outfits that I like, and then we'll get to the power armor. So let's get to the first set. Alright, so this is my number one. I already showed it to you at the very start of the video, but I kind of want to show it to you again, right? So from all more details. This is my number one. I love it. Let's go to my number two. Alright, now this is my number two. This is I like. I used to run with this outfit uh, when I was running through survival mode all the time. But instead of that bandana, I used to wear the skull uh, skull bandana. So it looks actually as well really nice. Just don't have it on me and actually feel that this bandana uh, like sort of replaces all other bandanas right now for me. So this is my number two. This is my number three when I want to feel a little bit more cowboy style with the red bandana, the black cowboy hat. So it really looks really, really nice. Also, as I said, the bleach mask also works with this outfit as well. I uh, hope I didn't get rid of it, did I? Pleasure, please. There we go. Oh yeah, but not the mat, not this cowboy hat. There's another one, this one right here, because it's sort of not super. Like you can see that it's breaking <laughs> the hat. <laughs> so yeah, that's number three. And when I feel like trading with other players, this is how I come and greet them. 
So, I like this a lot. This looks really stylish, really nice. Well, it, that bag doesn't meet. Oh, we got a customer. <laughs> so yeah, uh, this is. I usually wear this outfit whenever I'm uh, going to trade with someone from the Market 76. You're scaring off my customers. Cockroaches. It's okay. You can buy now. <laughs> so this gentleman is all about the customer protection. And the final outfit that I enjoy and I wear time to time is the bomber jacket <laughs> with the uh, 76 cap, the one that I've shown you. So this one I also wear time to time, and this is the least. So those are my favorite outfits what are yours but once again my number number one outfit you know it is the stalker one so i like that one a lot it's just a lot i've been running around since since ever i got it <laughs> maybe uh we'll get something cool soon all right so let's jump to the power armors this was my very very first power armor purchase that i actually wanted to do why I say it wanted because there's a paint that I accidentally bought and uh, luckily for me I got refunded and got to keep the paint as well uh, that happened to me I think in March it's a West Virginia paint which I'm gonna show you in a second here so uh, I just recently recently started using power armors that's why I don't have power armor uh, s skins and I don't think I'll have a lot of them I actually have two skins that I really like and I think uh, I'm gonna stick with those for now until I see something freaking legendary. <laughs> so uh, this is uh, what was the name of this one? Where is it? Ah, there we go. War Raider. War Rider. Rider. My bad. My bad. My bad. So uh, this is the War Rider, ladies and gentlemen. War Rider. Z Clan. Z Clan. War Rider. <laughs> Let's go to the next. One. All right, next in the menu we got the West Virginia paint. That's the paint that I messed up and bought by mistake. And then uh, Bethesda made a full refund of the atoms, which was a thousand four hundred, and actually allowed me to keep uh, the paint because it was my first sort of I don't know mistake. <laughs> uh, according to what they wrote in the meme email, is like uh, uh, feel free to keep it on the house, but don't do it again. <laughs> Sound like that. Alright, let's go to the next paint. Alright, the next paint is the Tree Centennial. Jesus Christ. Do apologize if I mispronounce that wrong because I am from Ukraine. Sometimes I do mispronounce stuff. Mm. Actually, I didn't even know that I had this. I think it came with that uh, plan that I purchased when uh, the game was coming out. So that's where I got the. Uh, that clean suit, forgot already with the name of it, the Amer American style suit. So let's see what else we have on the menu. And why the hell did I get out of this power armor? Can someone tell me, please? <laughs> let's jump to the next one. All right, and here's the next one. <laughs> Looking cool. I actually got it with the bundle. It's the hotter, hotter, hotter. What's the full name of it? Damn it. Let's take a look. Hotter something. <laughs> so it will be the hotter rod. And what we have on the next menu. Oh, actually, you know what? Let me quickly show you again a little bit more. It's a pretty good one as well. I like it. Let's go to the next one. And the final one. <laughs> I actually decided to buy it. It's actually right now up on sale on the Atom Shop. It's uh, June the 7th. It was up for two weeks, I think. So we have a little bit over a week to claim it. So have in mind, June 2019, just in case. I don't know when are you watching this video. <laughs> so I actually decided to buy it. It looks freaking gorgeous. It's amazing and I love it. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, I am extremely happy with my purchase, although it was pretty expensive, I must say. 1800 I think, if I'm not mistaken, but it's totally worth it. Look at that. The death from the shadows. <laughs> 
So yeah, that was my last power armor. Now, let me show you what backpacks I've got, and it's gonna be the end for that. So, this is obviously the best backpack. This is the best one from all that I own. Standard black shovel backpack. Here we go. What else do I have is... Oops, wrong one. Uh, backpack. Uh, so, the standard one and this garbage right here. <laughs> Let me just make it so you can see. It actually looked sort of cool, but in reality it's not. Maybe it would look alright with some outfits, but definitely not this one. My stuff, keep out. You heard that? My stuff, keep out. Alright, so that's pretty much it. That's everything that I managed to gather since beta and up to today's date, which is the 7th of June, if I'm not mistaken, 2019. <laughs> so I'll have more outfits coming up because I do review Adam Shop on a daily basis. I do buy outfits. I like outfits more. Uh, less power armor because I don't usually use power armor, so I will buy only the legendary thing that I feel like buying. Although there was one power armor that I regret I didn't buy. It was the death one from the riders, four riders we had. The death one, the black one as well, also looked really nice. So uh, that's pretty much it. You know the drill. Don't forget to leave that like. I hope you enjoyed the show. Always leave your comments down below. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. You have a good morning, day, and night. By the way, if you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. And if you want to help my channel grow, please do share this video somewhere in the media, such as Twitter or Facebook or any other platform. Bye. Uh -huh. Brother, Bratan, love you, Minya. Rock and roll, baby. Woo! <laughs> oh, this is gonna hurt. What? <laughs> I survived! <laughs> I survived! <laughs> I jumped out of that thing, I survived! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs>